I suppose the biggest challenge we face at the moment is um, data, getting data, getting data shared. Okay, the example I gave a minute ago about getting to the airport, how long is the queue in the airport, that's information that Ryanair doesn't have. That's proprietary to the airports. That information has to be exposed, it's got to be exposed in the standards, common accessible standards that all airlines and all travel agencies can benefit from. At the exact same point, I see that um, airports can benefit from the information that we have. They need to know that we've got five airplanes leaving at 2 o'clock and each one of them is full. That's a thousand people coming through their gates, get ready for it. You know, so it's a two-way two -way data sharing information is probably the biggest challenge we have. Thank you. I would from, from a passenger perspective, data, do you have enough? Do you need more? Um, we're not using what we currently have. <coughs> okay, we're going to go forward, we're going to use that data we have on the customers to improve the person, personalization of the experience, okay? Right. Again, if you're Irish, yeah, I don't I'm not going to do a rugby ticket, I'm joking. I was promising I wouldn't. Um, if you want to go with ticket, no, I won't. Um, you log on to the site, you're a business traveller, we know you're a business traveller, we know you fly Dublin, London every, month, every Monday morning at 7 a.m. You should hit the site, you should promise you wait. Do you want to book again? It's a yes, simple click on a button. That's the future, that's what data is going to bring to us. We're going to recognise holiday travellers who travel once a year and hit them then with a different experience log on to the page. Support them, i.e., hotels and suit them, family extra packages, that, that kind of thing. Okay.